Did you know that Biden's EV strategy has sent shockwaves through the automotive industry? Well, buckle up, because we're about to uncover the electrifying truth. With 80% of U.S. dealers giving a hard pass to selling electric vehicles, it's a story you won't want to miss. Stay tuned for all the jaw-dropping details right here on our channel. Let's take a wild ride through the EV market's ups and downs. Once hailed as the beacon of a greener future, electric vehicles faced reality checks as challenges like range anxiety emerged. The supply chain chaos only added to the turmoil, leaving dealers with unsold EVs amidst global crises. It's been a roller coaster of highs and lows, akin to throwing a party with no guests. Indeed, the EV market has seen more twists than expected. Now, let's talk politics. But don't worry, we'll keep it spicy. Biden's got a plan, and it's got folks talking. Picture this, two-thirds of new cars zipping around town with electric motors by 2032. Sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie, right? Well, some folks aren't exactly thrilled about it. While the dealers who are raising their hands and saying, hold up, slow down. According to a survey by Auto News, and trust us, these guys know their stuff. A whopping 83% of dealers think Biden's plan is a bit, well, ambitious. And who can blame them? It's like trying to fit a square peg into a round hole. Sure, electric cars are cool and all, but forcing them onto folks who aren't ready? That's a recipe for disaster. It's like your mom trying to make you eat broccoli. You'll do it, but you won't be happy about it. Then there's the challenge of charging infrastructure, especially for those living outside urban areas. Finding a reliable charger can feel like searching for a needle in a haystack, with the added anxiety of potential breakdowns. And let's not forget about range anxiety, the fear of getting stranded with a dead battery. Customers crave options beyond just electric cars. They want hybrids, plug-ins, and more. Until dealers and policymakers heed these desires, the electric revolution may progress slower than anticipated. It's like trying to change the world, one EV at a time. Picture this. You stroll into a dealership ready to buy a car. Easy, right? Not so fast, friends. Selling electric cars is a whole different ballgame. Salesmen are feeling the squeeze, with EVs taking away more time and effort to sell compared to their gas-guzzling counterparts. It's like trying to convince someone to switch to a new smartphone. They want all the deets before they commit. And that means longer sales cycles and thinner paychecks for the sales team. Let's talk about chargers. You'd think with all the buzz around EVs, charging stations would be popping up like mushrooms after rain. But man, that's not quite the case. Rural areas are feeling the pinch, with urban dwellers facing their own set of challenges. Long lines, wonky chargers, you name it. And if you're apartment dwelling, good luck finding a spot to plug in. It's enough to make anyone consider sticking with good old gas. Now here's a shocker. EVs aren't as reliable as you might think. According to Consumer Reports, they're causing a whole lot more headaches than your trusty gas-powered ride. From wonky batteries to glitchy software, it's a tech roller coaster. And guess who's left holding the repair bill? That's right, dealers. And with EVs relying more on software than ever, it's a whole new world of troubleshooting. Not exactly a mechanic's dream. Last but not least, let's talk dollars and cents. Selling EVs isn't just a walk in the park, it's a pricey investment. Dealers have to shell out big bucks for charging stations, training, you name it. And with the EV market hitting the brakes, many dealers are hitting pause on those investments. Can you blame them? It's like betting on a horse that hasn't even left the gate. And there you have it, folks. The shocking truth behind why U.S. dealers are giving Biden's EV strategy the cold shoulder. It's a rocky road ahead for the electric revolution. But hey, who knows what the future holds? Thanks for tuning in, and remember to hit that subscribe button for more juicy updates from the world of wheels. Until next time, drive safe and stay curious.